Hello ladies and gentlemen, this is JT from Above and Below the Belt. I have another topic to talk about, a boxing match that happened last night. Devin Haney versus Juan Carlos Burgos, which was a pretty good match. Um, it's just to see uh, where uh, Devin Haney is at right now. Um, I, it was a pretty good match, um, but Styles made fights. Um, De Devin Haney uh, frustrated uh, Juan Carlos Burgos. He, uh, he was torn with him. And he hurt him in the sixth or seventh round. Um, he was moving left and right. His jazz was on point. His 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 uh, uppercut was on point. Um, his movement, of course, at the same time, he's a, a slick fighter. He got the a Mayweather and the Royal Jones uh, style or uh, flow to him. And uh, the only thing he need to work on, uh, Devin Henney need to work on, is um, how to finish uh, fighters. I mean. <coughs> Right now, at 19, he should be finishing fighters right now. But at the same time, he's only 19 years old, so he don't have his man strength right now. He's still developing that right now. He's going, he's going, he's going to develop into that. Um, but he's looking really good right now. He's going to be a problem for a lot of fighters. Uh, I will say, um, I, I see why people say he's the future of the uh, boxing. And um, he's on the right path right now, but it's still a long, it's still a long way, still a long road to come to. Uh, to accomplish what he wanted to accomplish in uh, this uh, uh, sport of boxing, and um, this is a good this this was this was a good match for him, and he passed his test. Now I think for a world title, he need probably one more two two more people. I mean I'm talking about good uh, fighters, uh, probably B or A, probably B level fighters, whatever. Um, but uh, we'll definitely see uh, when he farther pro progress in uh, in the future and stuff like that. But uh, right now, um, he to me the way he's looking, he's looking like the future of boxing right now. And uh, like I say, he was he was torn with him, and uh, his movement is really good. His IQ in the ring is really good. Uh, like I say, uh, Mayweather's father uh, was uh, training uh, uh, him. So um, like I say, he was on point tonight. Um, but uh, I thought Juan Carlos did a good job too. At the same time, I mean. Juan Carlos knew who, who he was fighting. I know he did his homework on Devin Haney. Um, and you know what? You know what kind of surprised me about Devin Haney? He stood in the pocket too at the same time. Was boxing uh, Juan Carlos in a, in a couple of rounds, maybe three rounds after ten rounds. He was in the he was in the pocket, and he didn't do a bad job. He did a really great job. You know what I'm saying? So, um, but Juan Carlos Burgos is a tough uh, fighter, and I, I give I give I give all my uh, uh, respect for him. I give all my respect to uh, Juan Carlos Burgos. He knew he was fighting a slick fighter, uh, uh, a fighter that can frustrate you, who 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 rarely stays in the pocket. But he did this night in a sense. But um, yeah. So next next uh, I don't know who will be next for Devin Haney, but we'll see. And uh, what do y'all guys think about um, this boxing match? If even if y'all if y'all seen it tonight, uh, yesterday, um, leave a comment at the bottom of my page. Uh, subscribe to my page like my page hit the bell icon for new notifications and new videos from me uh, this is JT from above and below the belt alright bye